In this video, we're going to go over how to register with McGraw-Hill Connect, whether you have an account with McGraw-Hill or not, if you have to create one. So you log in to your course, and once you get into your course, it will look like so. You have to pass the online orientation lesson, online and hybrid. Uh, with an 80, you can take it as many times as you want. You must pass it in order to get to where we are going to go today to register your McGraw-Hill Connect account, which is under class information. So this account did pass the orientation, and that's why I can access class information. Under class information, there is a little green puzzle piece, which is what you're going to be clicking on. It says students click here to access slash register your MH Campus eText. You're going to click there. You're going to hit I agree, get started, hit connect. Now it's going to ask you for an email address. Um, and find my account. So it's flagging that this is a new user. So you would just put in the email address and please use your Essex email address. hit find my account. We did not find a matching account, so then you would have to create a new account. So if you don't remember, this is the way um, you can figure out whether you did create one in the past. You would just create a new account, create a new ac connect account and complete your registration. And you're going to go through all of this and hit continue. You're going to choose a password, choose a security question, accept the terms and conditions at McGraw-Hill Education, hit continue. And it's going to just go over what you're registering for, so make sure that's your course. Okay, in this case, it's financial and managerial accounting. You're not to pay anything, that's why it's zero dollars. Um, it's included, the e text and the connect account is included in your technology fee. You're going to hit continue, and your registration is complete. Okay, once again, this is how you would go about registering your. Connect account. It doesn't matter if you've had a Connect account for another class or maybe the same class in the past. You still have to click on that puzzle piece and go through the steps. Okay. Then you would go to Connect here. This is what a class would look like. Okay. So it would be divided up by chapters. Some courses are divided up by weeks. And then once you click, you can see what is due. So in this case, there is presentations, um, a learn smart, exercises and problems, and a quiz. And then you could see the due dates, okay? Um, we'll go here, back to the home button, we can see it all. And then of course, here's the e-text, which is what you wanna access, and it goes by chapters. You can highlight, take notes, print. You would click, let's say you're looking at chapter one. Okay, you can turn the page here. So there's no need to buy a textbook. If you run into any issues with registering your account, please um, call McGraw-Hill. Uh, this is their technical support line for students. It's pretty much 24 hours. It's 1-800-331-5094, and they also have a live chat and email. So if you want to write this down, I suggest that you call them. 
Um, again, that's only if you have issues registering your Connect account. I hope this video helps and good luck in your course this semester.